which will just the cottage. The will depart from the bottom of the well in 30 seconds. Please step aboard. This is the Geovader here at the Houston Museum of Natural Science. The Geovader will depart from the bottom of the well in 20 seconds. Please step aboard. The local time right now is 2.37 p.m., 14.37 hours. The geoveter will depart from the bottom of the well in 10 seconds. Please step aboard. Please stand clear of the doors. The geoveter is now departing. Hi, I'm Captain Mercaptain. Welcome aboard the Geovator. You are now directly over the borehole of a 7,285 foot well. I'm driving this thing from the cockpit right below you. Our downhole tests indicate we may have hit a pay zone. We're going to take this marvel of engineering here to the bottom of the well and find out. Hold on up there. We're going down. Bye bye, Houston, Texas. The steel wall out there is a surface casing. It protects the ground wire from drilling mine and keeps dirt and softer rock near the surface from caving into the borehole. One thousand. We're slowing down after finally getting past the surface casing. 3,000 feet. That's limestone out there. A sedimentary rock that could make a good reservoir. Now we're passing a series of shales, shaly sands, and limestones. 3,500 feet of them, representing millions of years of geologic history. That's a shale. That's a shaly sand, lim limestone, shale, lime shale. You get the idea. 5,000 feet. 6,000 feet. We're entering an impermeable shale here. The seal, just above our reservoir. We're at 6,800 feet. Our well logs tell us this next layer should be the pay zone. Black gold. Texas tape. Or maybe some natural gas. Let's stop and have a look. That's a lot. Let's see what's out there. Warning, this pouch open. Solid rock. Not a pool of oil. But the microscopic holes in it are filled with oil. That right there, that's Texas tea. This looks like a pretty good well. <laughs> A really good one, in fact. Now we've got to put in the production casing. That's a pipe that goes all the way from the surface down through the reservoir. It keeps the well from caving in and gives the oil and gas a dependable path back up to the surface. Here it comes now. Once the casing is in place, we use cement to seal the space between the casing and the wall. The cement isolates the production zone from water flows. That means cement. As you can see, the cement comes down the inside of the casing and then goes up the outside. Now all we have to do is wait for the cement to harden. Well, that was quick. Now, it's interesting. The oil and gas can't flow up the well yet because as you can see, the casing and cement are in the way. To fix this little problem, we use a big metal tube that fires high explosive shaped charges like anti-tank weapons through the casing and cement and out into the formation. This rather serious piece of equipment is a perforated gun. But instead of bullets, it fires those shaped charges. Here it comes now. Warning, perforating gun. This is the perforating gun. The gun is right above us. 
Stand by to perforate. You might want to cover your ears. Southwest Airlines! Perforation complete. Everybody all right? The holes, or perforations, now go deep into the reservoir rock. Because of the tremendous pressure down here, the oil and gas should flow through them up to the surface. Let's see how it's doing. Warning, out of It seems like it's a little bit slow. Looks like we're gonna have to do a frack job. If you like perforation, you're gonna love this. Sometimes when a well won't flow after perforation, you have to give it just a little bit more help. Frack is short for hydraulic fracture. A liquid under extremely high pressure carrying sand is pumped down the casing. It goes out the perforations and cracks the rock like an earthquake. At the surface right now, about 50 trucks are pumping liquid down the well all at once. Brace yourselves. The earth is going to move. The shock from the frack job just knocked us offline for a minute. Let's see if fracturing the well did the trick. Lefty Lucy. Look at this. Here it goes. Hooray! It did the trick. This oil is going to flow. We're going up with it. Hang on. Here we go. Now we're homeward bound. Yeah. We're heading home. We are heading home. We're heading home, yeah. We're heading home. We are heading home we are heading home yeah we are on our way home. Welcome home. 